I can't help but immediately warm to this building. It's not just the crispness of the lines, it's just that this represents to me the new tradition, contemporary tradition of Scottish home building. Yeah, it's magic. It feels pretty fresh too. It's literally greying before our eyes, isn't it? I think it's clever how they've kept the detailing to a minimum. You've got the standing seam detail on that connecting piece, which matches the standing seam detail of the zinc roof. It's definitely a home of two parts, isn't it? Will we see how they split up? Yeah. Okay, let's do it. Okay. Immediately, I recognise that. That looks like it's Nepal. These guys have climbed Everest. <laughs> <laughs> and yet the whole home feels like it's on one level. So maybe they've just had enough of climbing. I mean, this to me is an architectural education moment, a space like this. Is it choice or dilemma? And I have no dilemma here. I am getting drawn immediately to that wonderful picture view window through there. So I'm assuming that's the living room. There you go, Michael. Oh, straight away, the favourite spot. Well, I can see why. I mean, this is the perfect spot to sit and just look at that beautiful undulating countryside. I'm loving those wildflowers as well. It kind of looks like a ha-ha dipping down into that field. And I mean, it just goes on and on forever. It's so beautiful. And that lovely beach sill across there with the resin going through it, that's really clever. And then with the two windows at right angles, this window has given me a view just of trees. And I can see an owl box there. So this is maybe a good spot for spotting birds. I wasn't expecting it to be this volume, actually. For some reason, I was just thinking it would just be the flat ceiling. So it's actually a lovely, almost cathedral-like kind of quality to it. Really nice. Mm. You've got some really judiciously placed windows here. I mean, it's a lovely one here that's just throwing this light across the floor and then the journey continues with the view out there. So this is really, I think, been a rather well orchestrated positioning of the openings in the facade. The only thing I would say about this kitchen is there's not very much work surface. Whenever you're actually working, you're facing a wall. And even though that wall is a beautiful color, I think a little island unit would really work because then you could do your prep, you can chat to people that are sitting in the rest of the space and look at the view. Well, as a master microwaver, I think this space is actually perfect. Heat and eat. That's all you need. And you step out of your kitchen into this gorgeous little sun trap. Into oh. your kitchen garden. So simple and so effective just by offsetting the two bits of the building you create another room, an outside room. It's a gorgeous front fence if you're going to have one. It's high enough just to be private. It's especially private if you're going to lie down on that hammock. I'm going to have to <laughs> give it a your job. name. <laughs> <laughs> ah. Ooh. Ooh, it's a bit swingy. You're a swinger, baby. <laughs> I mean, I was actually expecting the ceiling to flatten off. I'm just glad it's still elevated for the tall guy in me. It's just nice to have your head you know, in the middle of the room. Head in the clouds. That's so, it. I mean, I'm looking at those frills. Like, you know, bedrooms are for frills, aren't they? I love it. It's like a modern room, but they've got that touch of old kind of whimsy. I really like the way they've got that dainty lace with the deck chair striped curtains. It's a kind of good contrast, which shows that they're not taking things too seriously. I'm also really enjoying that they're still obviously using their own things. I mean, that's a wonderful storage box over there, isn't it? Fantastic. You've got a little ensuite through there, and I'm spying some encaustic tiles. Is that how you say it, Anna? Encaustic. Yeah, that'll do. Every day's a school day. They're nice, anyway. And this makes this room really self contained. You've got your ensuite. I mean, this is a one stop shop. 